All right, welcome to audio class for the week of uh, April the 5th. Uh, we are going to be starting uh, a new project coming up. We are not there yet. Uh, I'm going to go over some Audacity things, and then I'm going to go over some things with um, uh, adding video and whatnot. So there will be several things that we do, putting little shows together and things like that. If you did not do your voiceover, it uh, it needs to get done. You need to knock that out and get that in. If you're having questions about that, please let me know. Uh, but I'm going to start off with a little, just a real basic uh, intro on some things with um, um, Audacity. All right, let me um, take that out and just start with a new. I'm going to record a section in Audacity. Uh, I'm going to walk through everything involved with it so that you see all of the things, the steps that take place. First and foremost, uh, if you're edit, make sure your mic is reading into Audacity. Uh, make sure that you've got what you need to go there. Uh, I'm just going to hit record. I'm just going to pop some stuff in here. Mic check one two. Mic check one two. This is a mic check for uh, my use of Audacity. I am doing this demonstration for class, and this is for the week of April the fifth. This is a training session. This is a practice session. On use of audacity. Okay, right there is the most important step. If I don't hit stop instead of pause, I can't edit. So it's completely de dependent upon me hitting the stop button instead of the pause. Uh, get it back in place. I am going to use my plus minus to get this so I can work it on one page. So I'm going to drop it down. And there I go. Now I've got where I've got it on one page. It's just a few seconds here. There are a couple things I want you to, to practice on doing. One is I want you to now if you look at my cursor here, it's not the the cursor is not uh, where I want it to be. It's on the selection the the, the moving tool instead of selection tool. So I'm going to put the selection tool and change it so my cursor's changed. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to, this is a good practice for every time you do it, I'm going to take a little section and I'm going to go to effect and the effect's going to give me a drop down. You guys don't see that drop down uh, but if you hit effect it's going to give you that drop down. I'm going to go down to noise reduction and when that little screen pops up it's going to give me some options. One of them is to get noise profile. And what's happened is this place that I've highlighted that's in pure white is where that noise profile is going to come. So I'm going to say get that noise profile and that screen has now gone away. Now, by getting that, then it brings me to my next step. I'm going to click off so I take that white part away and I'm going to do the whole thing. I'm going to select the entire process there. I'm going to go back into my effect. I'm going to go back to noise reduction. And then instead of noise profile, I'm going to say step two, which is select all the audio want filtered, which is all of it here. I'm going to hit OK. And that now has gone in and it's done a noise reduction, taking out what might have been just droning type noise from that. OK, so now I've got uh, back to my, my noise reduction is done. This is the next step I want you to learn how to learn to what to work on. Let's say that in the middle here, I needed to add some things. That I'm doing a voiceover for something, and this is where my voiceover needs to go. So since I'm on Selection Tool, I'm going to click right here, and my Selection Tool is going to come up. I'm going to go to Edit, and I'm going to go down to Clip Boundaries, and I'm going to go to Split. That, sign, that, that changed that line there. Now I'm going to grab this Movement Tool here, and I'm going to put it right here, and I'm just going to move that audio wherever I want it to go. So I can move it and I can add things inside of it and it can go just as I need it to go. Okay, that's the steps I want you to work on doing. I want to see, a, I want you to throw in some, some very basic audio. I want you to take that basic audio and I want you to do a noise reduction. And when that noise reduction is over with, I want you to move that audio. Now, I'm not grading this. I want you to practice this because as you start to develop and work that audio, you're going to need those tools. Uh, so this is what we're going to work on this week. 
Uh, I'll have some more information out for you at towards the end of the week. Uh, if you have questions, if you're missing something and something's come up that you need to work on, please let me know and we'll get you caught up. Otherwise, I'll talk to you towards the end of the week.